we're staying here with Jason and Jesse because our apartment is under renovation. I just really love waking up before everyone. Kind of uh, gives this more like peace. I love to miss my pretty much uh, my most like soothing part of the morning. And I journaled a little bit and today we'll be sharing what I eat in the day. Alrighty, I finished a quick light workout this morning and it is breakfast time. We found some like fresh mangoes at the Indian market and I think mango is my favorite fruit by far. I am going to have this with some coconut yogurt. I really love this one from Harmless Harvest. It feels like very light and like airy. And I made this chia seed pudding overnight. And I will actually show you guys how I made it. I just added three tablespoons of chia seeds into a cup, about half a cup of oat milk, some cinnamon. I didn't have maple syrup, so I added honey. It didn't work that well, but probably gonna taste well and a little bit of vanilla extract so yeah i am just going to put these all together and make a little breakfast I just feel peanut butter in any type of breakfast, if it's like oatmeal or just like with yogurt or granola stuff, it just makes everything better. Also, I did a little wellness q and on Instagram last week and I got a lot of questions about like supplements and vitamins and if I take them. The answer is yes. <laughs> I take them every morning with my breakfast so I don't forget. It's just like something in my routine. So I take Ritual every day for multivitamins. And then I take four capsules of Nutrafol every single morning. I think it's safe to say that Nutrafol just gave me so much more confidence. This is the only natural hair growth supplement which actually really works for me. And I don't know how long you've been part of the channel and if you remember my earlier videos in Williamsburg in Brooklyn. During that time, Max actually had bold patches on his hair. It was super random. And he started taking Nutrafol and slowly his hair came back. So I decided to give it a try as well because my hair is just very thin and fine. And especially, you know, on being on set, they put so many like hot tools on it. I've been taking it consistent for, I don't know, almost like two years now and it just like made such a big difference. I'm gonna show you right here. It's been like growing, it's been growing a lot. So I take four supplements a day. There's also uh, ashwagandha root in here, which helps like with stress in your body, which also can be the cause of, you know, thin hair or not a lot of like hair growth. And I actually have a special code for you guys if you want to try it. It is important if you try it to take it with your food because the fats in food actually help your body to absorb all the vitamins. And to do this consistent for at least three to six months to see results. Whatever you do in your wellness journey, it's never going to be like a super quick fix. And it is the same with this. I've been taking it for a long time. If you use code SONIF on the website, I will link it down below. You can get three bottles for the price of two. So, mm. vitamins. Oh, I forgot a spoon. And breakfast. I actually got a lot of questions about this uh, little ceramic bowl as well. I don't know the brand out of my head, but I will look it up and 
I'll still put it in the description. Oh, it's my favorite now. If there's one person in the world who just loves breakfast and can eat breakfast all year long, every single day, every meal <laughs> of the day, it would be Max. Mm. Avocado toast for dinner, a granola for dinner. Mm. But it's really good. It's almost lunch time. And I had this like leftover salmon in the freezer, but I'm like, I want to eat it, but it's frozen. So Jesse's going to teach me a trick. Cold water, you put ice. Cold water and ice. And then we put this with the bag in here. Mm -hmm. I, I've never seen this before. Look at this construction right here. Let's see how the salmon is doing. It's completely defrosted. Yeah, there you go. That looks pretty good. Um, I have some like, if you can see it, I have some like weird rashes on top of my eyes and I had them like a couple of weeks ago when I actually visited a dermatologist. She gave me this like balm and like med like a medicine cream I had to pick up and literally the day after I left it started to go away so I never picked it up but it came back. I don't know if any of you had this before and I should definitely not touch it. Anyway, so I thought it would be nice to kind of make like a clean green salad with like a salmon in, on it. I'm just gonna roast some veggies and put everything together. The veggies are done. I'm going to let this cool down a little and make the salmon. I destroyed this thing. Everything was going so smooth. Sometimes you just need some manpower in your life. <laughs> I don't know how you would do like. Yeah, I'm. Be careful of this thing, it's really. Okay, I'm gonna rinse these off quickly because I never like to eat them straight out of the pan. My summer salad is ready. So it's like broccolini in there, peas. Um, this is like a feta goat cheese. Chickpeas in there for some protein. And then obviously for healthy fats, I added avocado and I added like a small grilled salmon. So this is it. I also need to drink some more water. My big water bottles are in the other apartment. And I just noticed when I don't have those around, I just literally forget but when i have the bottle it actually just kind of keeps me on track i would say mm. if you're vegan i would actually recommend using like a vegan cheese or something in here because it matches really well mm. oh, the light is so pretty it's already like seven i am going to cook some dinner i have cooked so many different cuisines, so many recipes in my life and I have actually never made risotto and I thought it was kind of a little embarrassing that I just never made it I really do not know why so I thought today would be kind of fun to try out to make a risotto so I got like the special rice this is from New York Times mushroom risotto with peas uh, this is the reason why I bought peas and put them in my salad today 
So if it turns out well, I will link the recipe down below. I'm tired. So yeah, that's what we're gonna make. I'm gonna prep everything, make everything ready. I'm gonna start cooking some now. The basics is special risotto rice. I just got this one at Whole Foods. I got some vegetable broth and this is a piece of parmesan. Oh my god. Shiitake mushrooms and I have here some peas. And with this, obviously, I'm gonna pour myself a glass of wine. Jesse, you want a glass of wine? Oh yeah. have to say that twice. It's Friday. I also got white wine uh, to actually make the risotto. Cheers! Thank you! Max has been drinking my wine. He's like slowly, slowly getting there. no idea if I'm doing this right. It's supposed to simmer super slowly. I just need to add like some vegetable stock one cup by one cup. I mean, it smells delicious, but I don't know. I think we can add a little bit more liquid. I probably should have looked up a little YouTube video before I started doing this, but it is hot. Let me take off my shoes. <laughs> I need an apron as well. So I'm gonna grate some parmesan, which is literally one of my favorite cheeses ever, which we're going to add at the end of the... Hi. <laughs> oh my god! Ah, Jessie just pulls out an apron. <laughs> <laughs> is this yours? I got it as a gag gift. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess this is going to be my apron for today. It's actually cute because we don't have anything else. Yeah. And I just put a new t-shirt on it, which I didn't want to get dirty, so... You know what? This works. shouldn't be completely like overcooked but honestly I'm proud of it, it looks good so far we're almost out of our stock Dinner is ready. Salad, super simple with tomato and some cucumber, parsley, avocado. We have the risotto here and there's some like leftover salad and 
a lot of cheese. Oh my god. <laughs> it's not the light. My face is actually very tomato red. This is kind of my evening routine. I love to make like an oat gray or like a chai tea with some oatmeal and some honey. Kind of make me kind of put to sleep. You can see I'm like super red cheeks. And this is like one of my latest new obsessions. These are sourced chocolates and this is actually the glow. And it's a clean collagen dark chocolate. So they basically put like vitamins in chocolate so you have a couple of these and it helps for obviously like skin and stuff so besides that but also super delicious <laughs> i'm vlogging with my phone right now because a little too they kind of look like these little smarties oh yeah this is all i eat in a day i hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video let me know in the comments down below if you would like to see anything else <laughs>